G'day YouTube. This is not an update video, this is a help SOS video. Right, BMS. I want one, I need one, I've decided in my own head that it's the only way to go. Question. BMS, there's two different types. Charge controller, BMS, battery pack, or BMS battery pack, charge controller battery pack. Okay? How I understand it. Now, this device here pulls a maximum of 120 amps. But if it's not going through this device, that's not going to matter, right? Answer below. But, having, this is a 250 charge controller, which is not really. Right, do, okay, cut to the chase. Question is, get rid of that because it's shit. Do I need, this charge at 60 amps. So does that mean I only need a 30 amp and a 30 amp on this? And bearing in mind, I'm gonna get, I've already got access to a lot more cells, I'm gonna actually do another two. So I should only need a 30 amp and a 30 amp on this because that only charges at 60 amps. So it's got to dissipate a maximum of 30 amps per cell, but it's never going to actually do that because I'm never going to put the maximum amount of cells on this. Will a 30 amp BMS on each one of these packs work? Or should I double them up? So have a 60 amp on each one just to give me some leeway so they're only working at 50% capacity? Or should I just leave it at 30 amps and then once I get another two more, it's going to be 30 amps and 30 amps, which means it's going to be fine. Help me understand, is that the right way of thinking? Please let me know. I should give you a little update. I don't know what I can give you without giving too much away. But I'm kind of excited with the progress that's being made. Stay tuned.